Okay, I want to explain the controls on the um, tuner here. This is the uh, MFJ-941E. Here's our meter. The meter goes from 30 to 300 watts in the forward direction. 60 to 30 watts in a reflected direction. It's a dual meter. It will read the forward power, simultaneously read the reflected power. The red marks here are the ratio of the SWR. Okay. Here's the on off lamp. It works. Here's the high low power meter switch. Switches it from 300 watts to 30 watts. 300 watts forward, 30 watts uh, 300 watts high, 30 watts low. Okay. This is the antenna selector switch. You've got uh, coaxial. You got two coaxial cable connections in the back end of the uh, tuner, plus one external dummy load, plus a wire balance, <coughs> balance wire or balanced wire switch. So if you you have provisions for uh, two antennas, two coaxial leads coming in, you have direct on coaxial one here, first position, coaxial two, second position, uh, through the antenna tuner, coaxial two, third position, and coaxial one through the tuner, uh, fourth position. Now you have an external dummy load over here which you will switch in which you can use a dummy load with. Okay, this is the two uh, transmitter matching uh, capacitors. Okay, and this in the center is the inductor selector. This uses a solid core inductor, air core inductor. It has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve positions on the length of this coil and what you are doing are switching at different positions through the length of the coil from A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, and L. Right now it is set at D which is approximately uh, 20 meters and I had this tuned up to 14.300 megahertz okay with these settings now when you adjust the transmitter matching and the antenna matching the adjustment at 5 is half open so at 5 it's half open at 0 it's fully closed okay at 0 it's fully closed and at 10 it's fully open okay so at 10 the uh, the uh, capacitors are fully open so when you tune this you set the inductor first to get the lowest SWR and then these should be set at 5 when you're tuning it so uh, you select your band that you're going to be using here and this is D would be uh, put on the scale as 20 meters and then once we get to D we would adjust these capacitors either more or less so that we can tune or dip the, S, the SWR to the correct transmitter.